Hello and welcome back to my channel. If you do not know, my name is Ollie. So, I was on my calendar the other day. I always go on my calendar and I literally put everything that I have to do or when I have to do things on my calendar because it's a lifesaver, I tell you now. And I noticed the day this video goes live, on the 28th of March, that is where British summertime officially begins. That's a lot closer than I thought. Obviously, this whole video is COVID dependent, but in this video, let's pretend we're in like a world where COVID isn't a thing. Do you know what I mean? Like, let's just go with it. We're manifesting in this video that we're going to be Able to do all these things. So throughout this video, no one think of COVID or no one think of restrictions on social distancing because hopefully we won't have any of them. There's also might be another restriction in this video, which is I'm having surgery at the end of April and then four months after that I'm having part two of the surgery. But I want to make the most of it. So today's video, I am making a summer 2021 COVID-free surgery painless bucket list. So it's all the things that I want to do and have fun with in summer. And I always see aesthetic bucket lists on Pinterest and Instagram and I think that's what I want to be. So, I have got some yellow summery paper and I've got lots of crayons and felt tip in this pouch. Oh, they're all falling out. Oh no. And then some crayons in this pouch. Oh wow, I've got a lot of colours actually. I think I'm going to go for felt tips. I prefer felt tips. So let's go for a green, red, blue, a yellow, an orange. Oh, a light blue. I've got my felt tips, I've got my paper, and I'm going to try and make a fancy little summer bucket list. And I was actually going to just sit here and list off the things that I want to do, but I thought, let's make it a bit more fun, let's get a bit creative, and let's actually make a bucket list. So that's what today's video is, and let's get straight on into it. I am like so not aesthetic or artistic in terms of making things look pretty. Oh well. Summer bucket list. Also, I love how I'm doing a summer video, and I'm sitting with a hot water bottle because I'm freezing. But I have got a nice coffee, so. Number one. You know what, as well, a lot of the things in this, they might be turned into videos. So, if you're interested in any of them, watch the channel, because who knows what's going to go on. Number one. What do we do in summer? What do we do in summer? Summer. 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 I feel like High School Musical too. Ooh, let's go to the beach. Eat, let's all get away. Day, say, what are you going to say? Have a drink, clean, and come back. Bye. Come back. Go to the beach. Okay, so go to the beach. And I want to go to the beach because I love the beach. I love the ocean. I love swimming in the sea. I don't like the sand. I just like being in the sea. But I want to go to the beach, get a tan, hopefully get some vegan ice cream, you know, go to the beach with some friends, have a jolly good time. Ooh, ooh. So the next thing that I really want to do this summer, I want to get more tattoos. Get more. How do you spell tattoos? Is it T-A-T-T-O-O-S? I think so. Number two is get more tattoos. I love tattoos. Obviously, I've got my B here and I've got my Pisces tattoo on my foot. I don't know if you've seen the Dolan twins and Harry Styles. They have a lot of thigh and leg tattoos and I love them. They make it look so cool, so I really want them. But I don't want to copy their tattoos, but I do want more tattoos. Number three, okay guys, is going to be for you, which is I want to make really fun, summery, adventurous vlogs. I'd vlog a lot more now, but I'm in the house the whole time so I'm like all I can vlog is me waking up going on a walk having food like it gets a bit repetitive and boring for you guys watching and me to film but in summer when we're all hot girl summer free time fun time getting jolly we can film a lot more so three film super fun and crazy oh my god we're getting crazy vlogs three things on my bucket list oh I know something that I really want to do I really want to stargaze and like look up at the sky and lie there on like a date watching the sky shooting star, let's make a wish, you know, you can envision it. Number six is that I want late night fire pit, not parties, I'm not about bothered about partying, but like late night fire pit, all your friends, you can have a few drinks or you can have tea, whatever, but like late night fire pit, combos, blankets, cozy nights. Also, I feel like, because I said at the start of this video, I'm having surgery, like two lots of surgery, it is surgery, it's something to worry about, it's something to go crazy about, you're definitely going to see it, but if you want a video on it, me to explain it really, because I feel like there might be people, other people who go through this. But I don't know. But if you want that, let me know. I, this has been a seven year process of leading up to it. If you want a video on my surgery, I'm not saying I can vlog the actual surgery. I don't think I'll be able to do that. But me explaining it and what's going on, let me know and I'll do that. So number five is cozy nights with fire pits and friends. Number six, actually, I want to be a health and a fitness icon. No, I don't mean like, I don't want to like have a book and like be an inspiration for fitness to people. But I mean like for myself, I want to be an icon who is healthy and fit and on the eating game and working out. Oh, I hate that phrase exercising, be a healthy icon. For myself, I want to be like, go on, get it, do that extra up, eat that extra apple, you know what I mean? So I want to be like, healthy in summer, hot girl summer, that's a vibe, 2021. What else could we do for summer? 
Oh, I mean, there's an obvious one. COVID doesn't exist, so we're gonna put it because we banished COVID from the video. So this next one is travel abroad. I'm gonna put it in capitals. Just, you know, extra manifest it. Travel abroad. I am getting so good at homemade Starbucks, guys. Like, I'm gonna put them out of business at this rate. So number eight, hmm, summer bucket list number eight. I really want to do this. It's kind of similar to stargazing, but it's different, and I'm going to count it. Really, really want to, and I've always wanted to do this. I want to watch the sun rise. Do oh, no, I've done it all in lower cases, and then randomly, for some rise, I'm going to capital R. Stupid. Sunrise and set. That's what I want to do. I want, I want to watch the sunrise, and I want to watch the sunset. Because I think that's so cute. Like, actually, I have already got one thing booked. I think it's in May, and I'm going to vlog it, because it's going to be quite a fun vlog. It's going to be a travel vlog, but it's not traveling really but that'll be a vlog coming in may and that'll be fun actually so i'm excited for you guys to see that number nine in german i believe it is eins zwei drei vier fünf sechs sieben acht neun nine number nine number nine is okay and this again is inspired by pinterest instagram is it lizzo at the moment who's doing nature cereal i want to make I don't want to write aesthetic because a lot of words I might spell it wrong. So I'm going to make iconic and cute smoothies slash ice pops. That's what I want to make. I want to like blend the fruit together and put it in an ice pot, freeze it, and then like eat it later on. You know, because as well, a lot of ice pops and ice creams, well, ice cream especially, but ice pops, a lot of them have milk in. And I'm like, really? I can't have that now because you put milk in it. I mean, I didn't need it. So, so I'm going to make some dead cute, funky, aesthetic ice pops. Right, so number 10 is the next one. And we'll probably leave it at a number 10, really, because... Oh no. Number 10. I don't know if you all know this, but some of you might know, some of you might not know. Every picture I want every single picture, but like every nice picture, like a memorable picture of me, my friends, my dogs, my niece, my family, my life. Memorable pictures, I always print off and I put, I do photo albums. I have lost so many pictures and stuff on my phone, so I'm like, I can't go weird and things like that. So I always print off my favorite and most memorable ones, and so I have a physical copy. So for number 10, I want to make like a summer album, which means just from the start to end of that album, will just be summer. So do you know what I mean? It's like, oh, this will summer. Do you know what I mean? So it's like a really fun summer. So that's the 10 things that I need to do. Then at the bottom, I'm going to write a dead nice little message to myself. Have the best summer. Let's just recap my Phineas and Ferb summer. Number one is go to the beach. Number two is get more tattoos because I love tattoos. I really want more. Number three is I want to film some super fun and crazy vlogs. Number four, go stargazing. I want to lie there and I want to look up at the sky and see a shooting star and know that in that moment, life is okay. Number five is cozy nights with fire pits and friends. Number six is be a health and fitness icon. Number seven, Feels wrong to say, but travel abroad. I want to go on a holiday. I really do. I want to go away. Number eight, watch the sun rise and set. Not in the same day, obviously. It could be in the same day, actually. But that's like quite a nice like date night idea, I think. Number nine is make iconic and cute smoothies and ice pops. And finally, number ten is make a summer photo album because that means I can take pictures of every day, whether I'm with friends or myself or my family or whatever. I can just take pictures and fill a photo album, and then in like ten years, I'll look back and like this summer was a hot girl summer. And then at the end, I put, have the best summer. So officially today for you guys, summer has started. So this is the bucket list. It looks a bit like a toddler's done it, but that's okay with me because it's authentic and it's, it's lovable. It really is. So with the bucket list being completed, that now means my Phineas and Ferb hot girl summer is a go. That means this video is now over. That was so abrupt. This video is over. Bye-bye. If you enjoyed today's video, then please make sure you smash a like button and subscribe channel down below so you don't miss any more videos from me. Comment down below what you're excited for this summer or what's on your bucket list. So thank you for watching and I'll see you next Thursday with another video. Thank you. Hot girl summer.